Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Long hey guys, time. welcome back to jumping. Okay, Kirill, okay. Um, hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's been a while. We have <gasps> little baby Philip here. Look at him. He's getting chunky. Um, as promised, today we're going to do a, I'm looking for the light. I think this is okay. So today we're gonna do a realistic night uh with the newborn so it's gonna be the 12 hours he's three months so three months is still considered a newborn i think so he's a newborn now uh it's the summer vacation therefore one second kirill kirill baba mommy's making a video so it's the summer vacation so um it's it's uh, enabled us to kind of uh, rest a bit and find a new routine because our routine was already established so today I'm gonna take you on um, yeah a 12 hour shift the night shift as I called with baby Philip who is three months old now and uh, yeah let's go Annabelle yes the sun is here you, you can't even you can't even see me I'm in the light okay yeah. So okay, and let me check. So it is uh, seven nineteen. I'm gonna pop in the screen the routine that I'm uh, following at the moment. It goes up and down because um, yeah, I haven't been able to find a routine for this little one yet. He still wakes up at least three times in the middle of the night to feed. I mean, look at him. Look at this junkiness. And he's tired, so he's due to go to bed uh, in an hour. Um, so yeah, let's go. Annabelle, are you gonna help me? Uh, what are you doing for Philippe's night routine? Uh, well, first we need to change the nappy, wash him and everything. Oh. Well, like give him a bath. So what let's go. He's tired. So um, I give him a bath every other day, meaning yesterday he had a bath. So today I'm just gonna wipe him, especially his neck and he's not gonna get a bath today but tomorrow he will have the bath so it's not every day that i give him a bath and uh, i try to put him down at 8 p.m and before he gets too cranky so i'm gonna start doing doing it now otherwise he will start crying too much and he will not settle so let's do it quickly 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 okay 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 we're doing it Is sleeping now it is half eight and um, yeah the older kids should be in bed at um, 9 p.m. and I am hoping that they will not make too much noise so he will not wake up um, yeah it hasn't been perfect sometimes he will uh, be up by the around the time they're going in bed because they're still screaming and stuff um so yeah so max is doing something now he's busy doing something so i need to step up and take care of the other two or the kids and put, put them to bed so i'll do that now all right wait yeah. so show the matching nails so we have matching nails no. so wait, wait um we have blue matching nails blue and purple and um, well pink blue and pink so this is pink and then okay wait so wait <laughs> is so uh, matching and then the other hand matching so, and we and like um can even have the same color hands yeah so and i'm gonna start hand. putting them to bed 
Um, at 21. Yes, at 21. Well, they lights off at 21, so 9 p.m. Yeah, I don't really mind because I kind of like to sleep. But it's also, because it's but, the summer vacation. If it was school night, you would be but, at 8 p.m. But, but I, but I still wish I could sleep later. But, but I am very, very excited for 2024 because I get to skip until 22. I'm actually having postpartum. Hair loss, so here my edges are thinning out. I don't know if you can see. Actually, I think you can. So here. Yeah, I, I think they can see in like and there. And here, it's um. Falling. Yeah, it's falling off. So but far, it's, that's but all. But it's gonna grow back. Yeah, I'm not gonna do braids or anything because obviously the it hair might is shedding. Fall off. Well, I'm still well, uh, drinking my uh postpartum like the vitamins and stuff yeah, but but yeah this mommy. is this is happening i don't know if no i don't think this is also always like this but this is definitely <laughs> shedding and um, i need to find a day in the week to wash and uh, condition my hair again it's nice to have natural hair but boy oh boy it's a lot of work oh my hand my hand okay let's go get kiki and let's get ready for bed. And Annabelle, please go get the monitor so I can hear if if it's Philip is crying. It's in the living room. Let's go. I think people think I s we're standing. Oh, oh, Annabelle, my <laughs> tie, my tie. She's <laughs> heavy, my gosh. Okay, let's go. <laughs> yes. Oh, she is. Yes. See, it's how yes. difficult it is to be a mom. You just oh, yeah, yeah, heat yeah. and stuff. Okay, wow. let's go. Kirill? Yeah. Can you clean up your Legos? Yeah. And then it's time to eat. We have a quick shower and we go to bed, brush our teeth and we go to bed, okay? It's 11 p.m. So now it's time for me to sleep. I try to go to sleep between 11 p.m. and 12 p.m. And luckily today, Philip doesn't need a feed. Um, I actually gave him a quick feed around um, the time Annabelle and Kirill went to bed because as usual, they made a bit of noise. So. I gave him some milk to calm him down. So yeah, now it's time to go to bed. So it is around 1 a.m. and um, Philippe was actually fussy and he woke up for his first feed. It was a quick one. Um, I think I should learn to just maybe let him sleep because I tend to wake up at the slightest sound. So. Maybe this was a false alarm, but um, he still fed and actually do the night shift by myself um, since um, I tend to breastfeed him at night. Plus it gives me, it gives Max actually some time to sleep during the night. So in the morning he can take over and I can have three hours of undisturbed sleep. So it works best for us uh, that way. So less than an hour uh, before his first feed, he's up again around 2 a.m. And this time he's actually quite hungry. Um, it takes at least an hour to feed him at night. Um, I try to give him 30 minutes in one breast and 30 minutes in the other, just to make sure that he empty them. So he's a very good eater. So um, the journey to breastfeeding has been okay. And to pass time, I sometimes watch something on YouTube and it's a bad habit because it means that I'm fully awake by the time the hour is up. But otherwise, I just find it quite boring to just, you know, watch the clock as he's feeding. So um, I would be fully awake up until his next, his next feed and I will regret it. But this is the only way I can cope to do those such such long feedings at night. So it's 4 a.m. and he is up again. And like I said, I completely I'm fully awake, so I did regret watching my phone for the hour. But um, yeah, I don't know how what else to do because just going and going an hour in complete silence it's quite boring. So at this stage, I've been up from his last feed around 2 up until 4 a.m. and um, yeah it's not fun um, so it's 5 around 5 50 a.m. in the morning and yeah 
baby is up again for his next feed and at this stage I think I probably slept for an hour through the night and uh, I'm literally counting the minutes until I can hand him over to Max so I can have my three hours of sleep and yeah so it's uh, yeah it's quite hard but yeah that's how it is for the newborn stage anyways a couple a couple of minutes later well around half six so less than an hour he's up again and um, he's actually fully awake so he was actually um, I would say that he's been up since six and yes yeah, so he's fully awake and now it's time to change his diaper give him another feed cleaning up a bit and hand him, hand him over to Max and uh, yes yeah, so this night was quite rough if I'm honest I think he, he woke up at, at least five times I kind of lost count uh, of how many times he woke up and um, I probably slept less than two hours so I am exhausted and can't wait to just give him to Max so I can have my little three hours undisturbed sleep I tend not to change his diaper in the middle of the night unless if he has a spoiled diaper but um, yeah if uh, I'm lucky enough not for him to just have a uh, half pee I don't bother changing his diaper he doesn't seem to mind and those diapers are quite absorbent anyway so um, they don't bother him so it works very well for me good morning everyone um, good morning Baba. So yeah, um, he woke up at half seven exactly, fed, diaper change, burp, whatever, and um, yeah, we are, well, <laughs> we are, I am exhausted, however, look at him, he looks fresh as a daisy, ready to party, um, but yeah, he will have his morning nap around, I guess, um, half nine. And uh, yeah, but uh, this is it, 12 hours with the, with the newborn. And uh, it is tough. However, he's worth it. Yes, Baba, you worth it. Yeah. He's looking at me like he hasn't done, like he's all innocent. Look at him. But anyway, that's it, guys. That's the end of our video. Um, 12 hours with the newborn, a realistic routine. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Leave your comments below. If you're new to this channel, you know, please do subscribe. And yeah, thank you all, guys, for watching again. Thank you for your support. And we will see you into the next video. Bye. He's too busy with his fingers. Bye. Bye-bye. Yeah, okay. Bye.